I've basically been painting like say all my life. It's just one thing that I love to do. So it's never been a distraction for me or a headache or heartache or whatever. It's just something I love doing it. My name is Napoleon Hill. I've been drawing and painting all my life, and I just continue with it. And uh, the more I do, just uh, the more profound the work gets. And when people talk about your art, they're taken too with just how you really look at the culture of North Carolina. You yes. look at the culture of where you're from. Yes. Why do you do that? Hey, it's what it is. It's, this is me. <laughs> and the type of paintings that I do is what you see in rural eastern North Carolina. The cotton fields, the tobacco fields, the farm equipment, uh, the old farmers, the people. And sometimes when you do that, what you are doing, you capture your work, but you capture at the same time the better parts of yourself. And that's what makes your work out so well. Aunt Ruby's Peanut has been around for a long time. Some of your biggest fans, what are they going to tell me? I don't know. <laughs> so your family business across the street, and when you think about the murals and the cultural significance for this area, what does that mean to you guys? Uh, the mural exactly um, represents this community uh, and what this community has stood for uh, for most of its existence. This has been a farming community. So every mural itself has a story within the story. And everybody in this area you know about tobacco, peanuts, cotton, everybody can relate to it. And this is a credit to Napoleon's uh, artistic ability, but if, you, if you're coming across the tracks this yeah. way, uh -huh. the tractor and the man on the tractor appears to be veering off to the right. Yeah. And if you approach from the other way, he appears to be going across the I field to the left. Okay. Oh. That's interesting. I'm a firm believer if you don't use it, you'll lose it. So I'm glad to be able to share my gift with the, with the whole community and, and just share uh, the great things that's going on in various little small communities and, and kind of bring them back to life. And that's what it's all about. When I was growing up as a young boy, I always said one thing I wanted to do, I wanted to paint, but I wanted to share it with the world. So the Lord blessed me to be able to do paintings and murals on the outside where everybody can see them and everybody's exposed to the paintings and that's the best part about it all.